Alrighty guys, welcome back to another video. Me, Mitch and Josh out here in the boat. We're spending the night out just around the corner. We've just rocked up to a spot. We're catching a few whiting, pretty good size whiting. Josh just got one now, perfect timing. Um, sorry we haven't posted much. Mitch has been pretty busy with school and I've been pretty busy with work. Um, for the rest of the day, we're just fi we're fishing here for a bit, catching whiting. Then tomorrow we're gonna get up at sunrise and go out and try and get some nannies and shit. So yeah, we'll buddy. Yo. We're trying to keep the bit bigger whiting here so then you know we get a decent feed, a decent fill and you know only take what we need and I'm um, yeah we're just going to try and what we're going to do tonight for the plan is we're going to we'll show you our beach set up when we get back there but we're going to try and catch some sharks hopefully a gummy because that would absolutely be a treat for dinner we've got the gas cooker because it's five and season so we won't be using a fire but that'll cook us up a nice feed and we'll just chuck it in some we'll just chuck it in some bread and she'll absolutely go beautifully we've got a nice little hook up here josh got a little flathead and that that's gonna go size i reckon that's not a too bad a flathead probably 30 32 centimeters at max but yeah not doing too bad at this little spot to be honest that's out of a, that's a very healthy looking flathead to be honest with you but absolutely beautiful started off well we've only we've only honestly been here for like what five ten minutes and we're just getting hookups galore a lot a lot of different species all good tasting like flathead whiting and silver whiting which are all beautiful eating fish and i'm um, yeah i guess we'll get back intact with you when we're hooked up again but we'll size this little fella up first See how he goes. Just, just under, just under 29. Get a little release on this fella, and he's off. Rightio, it's blowing a gale at the moment, but Josh has got a yeah, it's pretty nice looking fish here. Oh, no. Yeah, I just... whoa, that's not too bad, Deron. That's not too bad. That's honestly not too bad. That'll easily go size. I'm saying about, what do you reckon? That looks like the flatty I just had that I lost yeah, straight I away. I think it might be. I so Razzy just had like something the reason. holding onto his bait and looked like a flatty and Josh has just pulled it up. Another healthy looking flatty. 32. 30, 32. Oh, no. 33. 33 basically almost 34 there 34. yeah 34 it is that's a Still that's good. a nice flathead first flathead that we're keeping we got a range we got the silver whiting we've got the flathead and we've got the couple tommies and just a tanger and a couple tangers so got a range of feed we're going to be eating supremely tonight so far and hopefully the way that the day's gone we'll catch a few more and i'm um, yeah we'll keep going we'll keep fishing we'll keep cooking on some good fish razzy's got a fish here i reckon tommy, uh, and he's got a little tommy, tommy there that'll, oh that's oh, a good like tommy good that'll, that'll be a beautiful bait right there and i'm um, yeah looking uphill from here we'll keep fishing the wind's gonna die die down at about six o'clock so that'll be beautiful hopefully get a bit of fishing in there before sunset then we'll head back cook up some tea then set the lines out from the beach there maybe um yeah we'll get back with you in a minute up again here and that's a good tanger that's an absolutely beautiful tanger that's a solid... this little spot here with i've never actually really fished here i think josh might have a little bit razzy hasn't and it's coming up with a good so far and look at that Beautiful eating size whiting. Straight in the bag, goes down a tree. Razzy again. Got another flathead. That one's, I think even, that might even be a little bit bigger. Or maybe about the same size. Oh, deep looking for me. Oh, and she, that's another healthy looking flathead right there. Razzy, got another flathead. We'll measure him up. Where do you get that? You're on that bit back. There you go. 33. 33. 
It's another size flathead going in the bag. Beautiful treat. We're not doing too bad here. Lots of flathead around, which is absolutely great. And I'm, um, yeah, looks like we're eating very well. Like, subscribe, and I'm, um, yeah. This is having a great run with this. Not sure what it is. Oh, two tramps. Beautiful. Oh, you're getting smacked. All right, I'll get back with you on the on the GoPro. Both on. All right, we got two ras, which isn't too great, but hopefully, uh, yeah, there should be some around here somewhere. We got two ras which is not the greatest but at least we know there's fish here and hopefully them trevs come back because they're going to be absolutely beautiful slimy greasy baits and they'll work an absolute treat and josh has a trev oh no another ass another ass absolutely beautiful scenes here like look at this not even in that deeper water to be honest we're only in what four meters of water here Absolutely scenic scenes, man. Beautiful. Alrighty, guys, we're just scaling the fish out the back, and then we're gonna go in, set our shit off, cook some tea, and then go out for a squid before the sun goes down. Try and catch a little bit more bait. Righty, oh lads. We're back on the beach, we filleted up the fish, scaled and did all that stuff. Now we're here, we got some pristine looking dinner coming up right now. We had a bag of chips which we just quickly put them in there and you know, shaked them up, gave them a good seasoning and oh, they're looking absolutely pristine. Just on a bit of bread, pretty plain, but you know, it's gonna treat us a treat. Razzie's got a bit just here, he's gonna Gonna have a lovely mouthful right now. She tastes good. Oh, mate, it's amazing. That's actually so good. We've done ourselves well here. And I'm, um, yeah, camp is looking quite beautiful. The wind's starting to drop off a little bit now. And I'm, um, yeah, we've done pretty well. So we're gonna dig into this, get some food back into us. And hopefully that'll give us enough energy to go out, fish some more, and give us a good night. You. So good, man. Alrighty, guys, we're just back at the same spot we were before, just out here. Josh has got a balloon out there. I don't know if you can see it. It's just out there on the big rod. Um, we're just catching heaps of silveries off silver whiting, catching them off themselves. The sun's just gone down behind the hill there. Got a cheeky little Yeah, got another flatty in the bag. Bloody beautiful scenery. Perfect night for a bit breezy, but that's all right. Um, we're just waiting for the breeze to go down a little bit and then we'll mainly target gummies and that's just a little bit windy right now. So we're just trying to catch some more bait and shit before we do that. But yeah, Josh has hooked up straight away. Well, that's, a good fish. that's not another a bad flatty, one. flatty, hopefully. Yep, another flatty. Oh, that, oh, that's, oh, that's, oh, that's a good, good flatty. flatty. That's a really good flatty, actually. Oh, oh yeah, that's a good flatty. It's not a bad flathead. Perfect eating size, buddy. Oh, that is literally perfect size. That's a good buddy right there, guys. That'll almost... Oh, that'd be like 35 almost. Beautiful little fish. This, this spot is literally going off perfect. We have flatting, flatties, whiting, and silver whiting. All beautiful eating fish. And yeah, well, buddy, get back to you when we get another fish, I guess. Yo! Good whiting. Oh, that's a nice whiting. Get it in, mate. Perfect. Oh, she absolutely destroyed the Perfect lighting. Beautiful sceneries out here. The wind is still crazy. You can probably hear it on the camera real bad. Wind. Oh, yeah, that's, that's bloody beautiful, lads. We got another one on the board. We're going to be eating well. We're going to provide, provide for the families as well. Um, yeah, this is beautiful so far. All we need is that lovely shark or just 
know that lovely big pelagic fish and set us up nicely for the rest of the night and I'm yeah. Woo. Just hooked up on another flatty. Oh, oh just a little one. Fought bloody better than it was. Oh, bow hooked, that's why. Oh, got it under its stomach, I bet you. Wait, hold on. What? No, it swallowed. No, it swallowed the whole thing. Oh, no, it's, no, no, no. Look oh, it's bow hooked, hooked in its gills. gills. Yeah. Josh's buddy hooked up now. That's a flatty. That's a good flatty. Oh, it's bloody taking drag. Oh no, what? It swallowed it through its gills. Oh, Jesus, Josh. Just taking him under the boat. Good fish here. No dead drag, bro. Oh, it's peeling. Jeez, it's a bloody big ray. Sun's going about to go dark. Got about 30, 40, oh, about 30 minutes left of light, if that. And then hopefully we can get into some of the bigger fish in the night. Yeah. gone around the front, it's going change directions now. Oh here it is. Oh it's gone under the boat. Oh shit. Possibly oh I thought it was snapped. It's gone under the boat. Jeez this ray's been a hassle. Scenes right now, holy moly. Beautiful out here in the boat. So that ray spent me a little bit, I'm not gonna lie to you. That's just your drag, loosely. And yeah, so we haven't really got much after that. There's just been a couple Tommy swimming around. Josh's bait hasn't been hit of what we know of so far.
And um, yeah, so we've been pretty chilled out. Razzy just dropped his bait in, but we're about to head back around the camp and go off the beach and that. So yeah, hopefully that can supply some goods. But if not, I guess we'll catch you up, up with you again. We're going to cook up them flathead that we caught and them little tangers and whatnot. And um, yeah, we'll catch, catch back with you in a minute. Yeah.